Yes, sir. Big Baby JTV. I want y'all to smash a like before I get it started. Ready to get it started. Bitch, I got no sense. Anyways, man. Kawhi Leonard out with a knee injury, a possible ACL. That would pro- that would end his entire playoffs and would probably end a chunk of his next season. And now Chris Paul, who uh, got COVID after being vaccinated in uh, February 2020. Oh, 2021. My bad. Time's moving fast. But long story short of what's going on now is we have a situation where the winner, the champion of this NBA season is going to be the healthiest team. And not only the healthiest team, it's probably going to be the youngest team. Why is that? It's because the 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 NBA, its owners and the commissioner were using greed. Greedy as hell. Okay? They signed TV deals that they had to keep, right, in order to make money. And they, in order to make money, they decided to have one of the shortest off seasons in sports history, right? About 50 some days. And they put these players back to work. They put these teams back to work. They put these medical staffs back to work. And guess what? In a, at a certain sense, I get it because this helps keep money in people's pockets despite the pandemic. But at the other end, at the other end, you're having a record amount of injuries to NBA players. You feel me? What's happening right now is these players, LeBron James, AD, Kyrie, James Harden, all of these guys getting injured in the playoffs is not a coincidence, bro. It's not a coincidence because once you overexert your body to a certain level, people can't take it no more and their body can't adapt. Your body can only take so much punishment. Look, right now, in the playoffs, the most physical time of the season, okay? The most intense part of the season, okay? Everyone, everyone who is good is injured. Every single person, okay? In these playoffs, this is the most injured all amount of all-stars in NBA history. You had Anthony Davis. James Harden, Donovan Mitchell, Mike Conley, Jalen Brown, Joel Embiid, Kyrie, Chris Paul, and now Kawhi. Right? And not to mention the people who are playing with injuries who didn't even announce it, like Trey Young. This is crazy, bro. This is crazy. That's why I'm telling you, the person or the teams that win this year's NBA championship are going to be the healthiest that's one and probably the youngest okay phoenix suns are probably gonna win this or the atlanta hawks it sounds nuts it sounds crazy but those are probably gonna be the one of the two winners because this is what's happening now the nba has greedy owners commissioners and and the infrastructure which is so obsessed with keeping these TV deals so that they are forcing their players to play. Think about it like this. The league has 300 plus players. Guess how many played all 71 or 72 games this season? Nine. Nine players played every game this season. Why is Jokic the MVP? Because Joel Embiid was injured for a chunk of this season. That's why. Crazy, but true. And the NBA has nobody to blame but itself. Big Baby JTV, we out.